hello so today i'll be showing how to do this changing the screen brightness through keyboard shortcuts and i'm trying this on my laptop but i think it should work for desktop as well so this answer is already so this question has already been answered over here but this didn't work for me so i decided to write my own answer and i think the text is a bit difficult to follow so i decided to make a video of how to do this so first thing you need to, which you need to do is install this dconf editor it can be installed using this command uh, this command and the link to the qu question and my answer will be in the description so just do this and then it will install dconf editor so the first i'll explain how my how the workflow would be so first what we will do so basically the idea is that in the dconf editor you can access the sh keyboard shortcut values for screen brightness up down as well as volume volume up and down but in the settings app in the shortcuts field you cannot access the screen brightness you can just access the volume uh, you can just change the setting the shortcut for uh, volume so what we will do is we will uh, update so yeah so another thing is that this uses special syntax over here example i'll show you yeah and this is a bit weird and special syntax if you know the syntax then you can just head over to this thing screen brightness down and then just put that just disable this and then put that special value over here but i'm not really sure most of you might know it or not so the hack which we'll do is we'll change that value in over here so what i would like to do assign for screen brightness down is uh, windows alt and then the tilde button the tilde button is the button which is just below escape so i'll do that over here and then this th once i set this the value will be also be changed over here so you can search for volume down and then you can just copy this value then again search for screen screen brightness down this screen brightness down and then paste that value over here and then press apply so once this is done you might wanna reset this to the previous value which you would like thank you